inside all this tension A feeling I never was expecting I don't see the pros, don't know the cons, forget the whys Do you know why? treat she's gonna be having her a banana split breakfast really simple really easy to make something different for her to have halo you think you gonna like it <laughs> we have a fruit lover like myself and they love yogurts and they love a banana split look at here it's just a way to spruce up their breakfast in the morning Good morning, you guys, and happy Monday. Um, this is what Halo is going to be having for her lunch for this week. She is going to be having a bacon BLT, bacon, lettuce, and tomatoes sandwich. She has some raspberries and some blueberries and some pure leaf pickles. They don't have all other stuff, just kind of like organic pickles. And for her drink, I got the very berry uh, apple and Eve juice. So that is her lunch for Monday. Well, hello and good morning, you guys. Welcome to Tuesday's Lunch. I am doing a voiceover simply because I did a music background in the previous clip. I'm not quite sure if you guys would like to have music in the background when I'm sharing with you guys how I prepare her lunches. Be sure to give this video a like if you do, or let me know in the comment section, ah, oh, Ebony, no music, or just maybe not music all the times, but we'd like for you to share how you do prepare her lunches. Um, so just let me know down in the comment section below. I will truly appreciate it. And today, what she's having for lunch, you guys, is called a Sonoran hot dog. It's like a Mexican street hot dog. If you haven't tried it, oh, <laughs> you've been sleeping under a rock. This is definitely a chef's kiss. You have to try this. You will never have a plain hot dog ever again. Trust and believe. I hope you guys enjoy. Stay safe. Just gonna be having a hot dog wrapped up in bacon. Um, I actually like to do the whole nine. If you guys follow me, you might have seen it where um, you put the onions and the bell peppers and you put some um, pinto beans on it. It's like a Sonoran hot dog. 
if you haven't tried it, let me tell you, you try it, it will change your life. But this morning, you guys know I love when I prepare Halo's food. I love using my air fryer when I have to do little quick cooking. Um, it's very, very reliable. Um, I did get asked over the week. Last week, um, do I like my air fryer? Does it work? Do it burn food? No, it actually helps you from not burning your food. You, they already have these pre settings. So that one is like for french fries. You have, you can bake cakes in here. Shrimp. Y'all know my baby loves her shrimp. Uh, bacon. I love cooking bacon in here. It always comes out perfectly. You can do chicken. That's some steak. Some fish. And all. So... You can also set it to your own temperature. That's why you have the time here where you can set it. And then you also have the temperature gauge where you can change that as well. Um, so like I said, I absolutely love, love, love cooking in an air fryer. Not only just for Halo's food, but as well as... Um... Okay, so now I'm going to spray it. And I'm just using some Pam. And I'm going to... Stick the hot dog in there. All right, y'all. So that is the hot dog. Um, I'm going to let it cool down maybe a little bit before I put it in the bun here. I just have a bun. I put some mayonnaise already in there for her. And I'm going to wrap it up in this foil. And a little paper to preserve her hot dog for lunch. This is Halo lunch for today. I already showed you guys the hot dog. I did toss in some Australian cheese on the side. Her fruit, she's gonna have some, what is these, are tangerines? Or nectarines, little oranges, baby oranges. Um, some blackberries, raspberry, and two sides of pickle. We are doing it. I did pack her lunch in Jose's old container. Um, just to simply share with you guys, uh, I did get message, do they have containers for older kids? And they do. These are for the older kids as well as adults. It does hold a lot. Um, it's pretty much like the kids one. As you can see, it does have like a, a divider that I took out because look at how big and spacious this is. Just in case you were interested. Um... And you get two other little compartments as well. These work good uh, when Jose was using it. Uh, he said that it would keep his food nice and warm when it was warm or cold or whatever. He really liked it. But like I said, I don't pack his lunches no more. So the containers come back with me. <laughs> that's just how it is. Plus, Halo can use them. So as you guys can see, so that's what she's going to have for her lunch for today. I'm just going to pack it in her little lunch bag and it fits a regular size lunch bag you all i'm going to put her ice pack on the side to keep her fruit cool and that's it let me and this is her drink she's going to have a fruit punch and halo been asking for me to put notes in her lunches so i did buy a bunch of these uh, pre already made lunch notes for her um and she likes that in some you can write your own little personal thing on personal saying as you guys can see there i actually do like these um i got some from the dollar store i believe a while back when they was having them and target as well i also have these too super cute i love you 
by Hello There. Just different little saying. And here's some more little lunch notes that I picked up. Target Dollar Spot. So when you see these type of things, definitely get them. The kids absolutely love them. So I'm going to, this one says, you'll make me smile when you, and you just write whatever personalized thing on there. So I'm gonna note out for her. I like this one because it says Friday, happy Friday. Oh, this would be cute for today. <laughs> says good luck, top dog. Since she's having a hot dog, I think that'll be perfect for her lunch. So I'll just stick that in there. Set and ready for school. I might put her drink on the side here. Instead of there, so I don't get smashed up too much. She ate all but one little bite of her hot dog. Left the pickle and she ate the majority of her fruit. She didn't, however, drink her juice. She hasn't been drinking her juice lately. I don't know what's up with that. She preferred drinking her water. So even the juice water, she's not drinking those either. So mm, maybe I'll stop putting them in there for a little while. Hey okay, y'all, happy, what is today? Oh, Thursday. Um, this is what Miss Halo having for her lunch. This is per her request. Um, so starting off our main course, she wanted some shrimp kebab. So I did the best that I could to make a little kebab for her. It's just cucumbers, shrimp, and I put a little lemon on the end where she can um, squeeze lemon on top. Here she has her favorite tartar sauce that she likes for me to make. I just put some butter crackers on here. I don't know if she's gonna eat it or not, but whichever. And then here is just some um, apples, red and green apples for her fruit. I'm not gonna pack her a juice today simply because she hasn't really been drinking it. She says she prefer her water. So we're gonna leave it at that. If you have any questions, it's okay that her shrimp is not warmed up. We definitely eat cold shrimp here, um, just as long as it's cooked. So that's not a problem at all when packing um, lunches, just in case anybody else is interested. Because I know a lot of you guys say, oh yeah, my kids I love shrimp too. So yeah, you definitely can um, pack cold shrimp, even though I just make sure that it's fully cooked. So that is her lunch for Thursday. I will show you guys how she did when she gets back home. Okay, y'all, we made it back. If you hear noise, cause I have dinner in the air fryer. Um, quick tip, uh, I don't know. I think this might just been one day, but Halo says she's been having a hard time with getting her, which as y'all can see is kinda not all the way close here. Hold on. having a problem with getting her lunch bag her lunch box out of this bag um it does sit kind of halfway up uh, that's just the way it's made so i'm thinking about getting her another lunch bag uh just for that reason let's see here okay i was seeing this stuff spill let's see how she did for today okay she didn't eat all of her little apple fries. She picked over that. She didn't touch this at all. Yeah, she she tears up that tartar sauce. And she ate all her shrimp, but of course she left the veggies. Oh, she didn't even squeeze her lemon. Huh, what happened with that? Where's the other stick? I don't know. But um, yeah, so that's how she did for today. Um, and I don't know 
what I'm going to cook for her tomorrow. Let me take this out. I have no clue, but I guess we will see in the morning. Okay, y'all. So, hey, what's a lunch for today? She is going to be having a spicy chicken sandwich wrap with um, lettuce, onions, gouda cheese, and this Hidden Valley secret sauce y'all this is amazing i made this chicken sandwich for me yesterday and it was it was busting i mean it was busting okay really really good if y'all haven't tried i would say give it a try if you like that little um ketchup mayonnaise on your burgers and sandwiches this is absolutely good she's gonna have some blackberries and raspberries i did just throw in the string cheese for her as well and then this is a little sweet treat a little um Brownie cookie dough topping little treat for her that I had got at Little Caesars the other day. And then for her drink, she's going to have some Nesquik and sh uh, strawberry. So some strawberry milk. So that is it for her lunch for today. I will try to remember to show you guys how she did when she gets back. Found myself inside all this tension. A feeling I never was expecting. I don't see the pros, don't know the cons, forget the whys